people that are following and then I come back behind to usher them all through and they're crossing over. That's the alignment, that moment in time when all the wheels are aligned and we cross over. That's right. The saints, us, all of us. Hmm. It's when the cogs of the wheels within wheels of Ezekiel line up. Line up. So we have, if you look at the Mayan calendar, you'll see that on YouTube all the time. Mm. You've got one little cog within the other. Well, it's right. Mm. This is angelic scent. Mm. So we know it's angelic scent because it's accurate within 33 seconds in 500 million years. doesn't mean you've been here for 500 million years. It means you're going to be here for 500 million years. Scary, <laughs> So I was going to tell you the story about uh, consciousness and how it works. Um, I was building this uh, boat, uh, miraculous thing on Sprout Lake in Canada, and of course I was trying to get attention, and people were coming miles around to see the strange looking craft. I was building a, a float, it was all cedar floating on a bubble of air. The top floor was a sh with the shape of uh, a shield of uh, King David, and then there was a tree that was petrified that come miraculously floating across the lake, and wedged under the wharf, and uh, Kenny Wilson, it was with me. We uh, set that up as the mast in this boat, and then um, out of um, uh, cedar, I built entirely the the uh, spiral staircase going up, and and it was all for kids, right? And I baptized a little girl in there, and she was 8.88 years old, and all this kind of thing. So um, <clears throat> what happened after that was the attention, of course, was being drawn to myself, and I was already already up on a charge of uttering a death threat. But uh, I'd also been involved with the mental health. Uh, Dr. Helen, become a good friend of mine. Uh, we used to sit and talk an hour a week because I was uh, manoeuvring the Workers' Compensation Board to give me a pension because I needed to have some sort of support when I have to do what I'm doing today. And I, I did have a very serious um, uh, two back operations, but they put dye in my back that you're supposed to take out and people who have taken out uh, will die an agonising death. It's a dreadful thing. Uh, they left it all in me, trying to kill me, so it didn't work. So they end up pensioning me off for that, and that's how I can sort of live this lavish lifestyle. <laughs> Shopping do, at Vinnie's? Do what, and yeah, look, there's Vinnie's, we can always go there to get uh, our clothing, which is I'm wearing. <laughs> That's, That's why he's in the same shirt, <laughs> same jeans. Thank you, Diana. For your We've got two jackets the same now, woolly line, because Diana got one from Vinnie's in Nimbin, so now we have matching woolly jackets. All right, now the wheels within the wheels is very important if you look at the record that I've been putting up on YouTube for years uh, about the check business and uh, the minting of coins and all that kind of stuff. And uh, it all becomes uh, blatantly clear when the... Um, 3168 number is Lord Jesus Christ in Greek Gematria and how it is only found twice in Ezekiel and it's Ezekiel uh, 2424 is what we're talking about which is re revealed by the Australian Mercantile Law of the very uh, law that I broke altering a customer's cheque is what I was accused of. The interesting thing was it wasn't my cheque it was my wife's cheque and I took the rap for her because she had lost a baby. Uh, our baby son had been murdered by doctors. Mm. And that become what's linked into this last thing that I now discover, you have uploaded a letter to Raz, which is private and confidential of course. And uh, <laughs> uh, Trinity is the key to all this because she is the last link of the royal line. And so Adam has been in hell from the sin metaphorically from the fall of Adam all the way through for paying man's sin. He, he took on the sins of mankind because it was his seed that was committing them. And you're responsible for your offspring. So this is where Cain comes into it. So it's a, a conscious thought. Now, when I was building this boat, I had ordered some uh, glass <clears throat> that was the plate glass you get indoors, sliding glass doors. And I had 21 sheets of it. And I was positioning this around as windows and uh, odd things on this uh, beautiful cedar boat that I was building. And um, I picked one up to carry down from where it had been uh, uh, left in the cedar pile with the glass on top of it. I had to step over it 
carrying a sheet of glass and then walk down the stairs to the dock, down to the boat. It's usually lakes on there below the house in most cases. Little joke there. Oh, sorry, no. <laughs> Still typing with Adam. I've just told him. The other one's a submarine. <laughs> so as I'm stepping over the cedar, a big ball of light come around me. It's a consciousness of my consciousness in silver and gold needles, it look like, in um, so so much bright and brilliant complexity that you can't see out of it. And that was surrounding me totally. And it was about, I don't know, it's hard to say, uh, at least 16 foot from me, so it makes it 30 feet across or so. Anyhow, um, a voice, my voice, that I heard when I was a child said to me, and I heard it once, one other time too, when I walked into the parents with our partners meeting in Bankstown in Sydney, and I seen this woman walking in front of the stage, and a voice said to me, Marry that one, like this is my first night out after being married and divorced. All right, now. Getting back to this story, um, the voice says, squeeze it. I said, what? It said, squeeze it, so I did. And as I did, the glass disintegrated into a million bits and formed a line of glass that was 197 inches long, which is Brian Little Marshall, you see. But the location where I was doing it at, the, the house um, lot numbers were all uh, miraculously maneuvered through time uh, to have the lot numbers change. So 81, and it was formerly lot 3, so it was 84. And then you had uh, 82, which was formerly lot 2, which is 84. And then you have uh, so on, you have 84, 84, 84, and 84. And that's my sister's phone number in Australia. You know, there's, there's things like that, which is Marshall and Emmanuel. Marshall, mm. Emmanuel, Marshall, Emmanuel, Marshall, Emmanuel, and so on. The whole uh, layout of those lots on that lake, at Scrap Lake, and the, the size of each of the lot and how many hectares are and how many metres per side, all tell a miraculous story, which I've got copies of before. Now that is something that the people in, uh, the Indian people, lovely folks I know in Port Alberni, they should get into it and work all that out. So what I'm saying is the consciousness of your angel being without you uh, is you are the vessel that's manifest to be able to live the life that I had dreamed up for you as a perfect environment where you can feel and touch and love and, and experience all those wonderful things and your consciousness surrounds you like a big sphere. Right now, as we're getting closer to the uh, crossing over on the 21st of uh, December 2012, um, that is coming closer and closer and closer to you and finally it will be within you. You'll become a complete human being as I intended in the first place. That's all good. Yeah. <laughs> it's not that difficult, is it? <laughs>